Hello everybody, I truly hope that you are doing very well and welcome to today's cryptocurrency technical analysis where I'm going to be running through the live price action as it's happening here on the Bitcoin chart, what I'm looking at for the rest of the week to come, including the very must must know important levels here that I'm currently trading from in my short position. I am in a short position right now on Bitcoin. I'll be explaining why and what I'm looking for next, um, you know, to terms of my targets and invalidations on these trades. So I hope that you thoroughly enjoyed the video. You're obviously here to learn a bit of technical analysis, understand my levels and know what I'm looking for next. So let's get straight into that. Hey, um, and I'm going to start off with, I'm going to do this video in three different sections. I'm going to start off with where I left off my last video on Friday and explaining this recent price action. Then I'm going to be moving on to why I'm in that short position and what I'm looking for next. And then explaining why we're still looking at the ES stock market, DXY dollar index. And if it's of interest to you, I'll just touch a little bit on altcoins because they're seeing some nice volatility right now. No? Um, and yeah, without further said ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into what we absolutely love. And that is here trading on the Bitcoin chart. So I've said it once and I've said it again, blank chart, totally gambling. We have no idea without our technical analysis what's going to be the highest probability next. So let me add on the technical analysis that I done last night in the Champions live stream. Boom. And now this chart is suddenly brought to life. We understand why we are currently range bound. Why is that? Well, as I was explaining in Friday's video for free to the public, we have to have patience. I was obviously showing you the short position that I was in for about $1.5 million, that hedge. And why I was looking for another move to the downside to hit our value area high. And of course, that went exactly as predicted. Um, and if you thought that prediction was good for free to the public, well, I'm about to show you a 30 second sneak peek inside of the Champions Discord group. And if, I mean, if you thought the free public prediction was good, well, this is going to blow your mind because, as you might know, if you've been around long enough, I do all my magic lines every so often and price action just follows these to the absolute tick. And here we see the prediction that I made on the 27th. Of what I'm looking for next. Obviously, you had our CC resistance, our value area high support. And I was basically looking for a move down to take out our $20,000 liquidity zone before another move to the upside. So looking basically what I was kind of explaining in my free public video, but with the exact line to follow, right? And then, of course, there's the advantage of being inside of the champions group. You have access to the coaches only, read only channels. This is just clear concise information given to you and you know, obviously you have the questions channel if there's a bit of confusion why am i looking for this exact level why am i then expecting the pump you can ask the question here you get the answer so here we see frank asking the question why is 19,991 that very key important level back on the 27th i explained it's the value area high it's the horizontal level it's the anchored vwap and it's the psychological 20k number eg this region of 19,991 is my key level for all of the confluence that we have here. That is why I was looking for this move to come down, hit my big level of support, and then get a pump. Ladies and gentlemen, as you may or may not know by now, that went exactly as predicted. This short position played out very nicely. As then on down here, we see that lovely move to the downside, the hit of support on the 28th. One day later, we then get that pump underway. So from the prediction, we saw the absolute play out exactly as predicted. And I'll say this once, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to see these predictions before anybody else over here, then you need to be inside the Discord. That was the exact prediction that I gave. One day later, we see that exact prediction play out exactly as predicted. And that's what I mean, ladies and gentlemen, in this market, you're going to get the insights. You're going to get the predictions. You're going to get that before everybody else, live in the time, before the move has happened. There's no nothing else you're going to see there apart from pure pure predictions. So that's how I hope you've enjoyed that one. And now, as we can see, that led to a large rise to the upside as we were looking for take out the low, get that rise. We took out the low here. We got that rise. Where? Well, let me just explain this very simply for you. Here, swing failure pattern of the low, large rise to the upside. What happened at the high? Swing failure pattern of the high, large move to the downside. What does this signify? We are totally range bound. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got our clear resistance and have a guess what? It's our CC. Our CC is our clear resistance. And currently we've got our support, which is still that value area high, which is obviously down there at around $20,000. And this is giving us our current range. Low, high, low, high. Coming back down to the low, right? So here we can truly understand exactly what we're looking at, what we're looking at next in terms of our, 
our, our, our levels right now to be trading. So once again, I can say this requires a bit of patience right now. So what could we be doing in terms of patience? And actually, I'd like to just explain this quick move to the upside. This was actually a relatively easy short to take on a compounded trade. Why? Because we saw this move to the upside as the ES was continuing weak. So last night, the ES opened with a gap to the downside continued weakness all night, continued weakness all morning, and Bitcoin got this like late short squeeze, late short squeeze to the upside, which was a really nice, easy, like compounded short. Why? Because the ES was so weak. Bitcoin coming up into the point of control, taking out some highs, you know, and then it, you know, just continued weakness, falling down with the stock market continuing to fall down. So if you understand the correlations, DXY rising, ES falling down, Bitcoin, a large move on its own into the point of control. You know, it has given another opportunity for a short there. Now, obviously, we're seeing this continue range. So if you are under the uh, impression we're range bound and you want to wait for the range low or wait for the range high, well, the altcoins right now are offering some very nice volatility and very nice trades. What I will say, if, if you want to see an altcoin analysis for me, be this Shiba Inu, be this Ethereum, be this, you know, Atom, Algo, Tezos, Dot, whatever you might want, let me know in the comment down below. Comment the altcoin that you want to see. And the highest voted altcoin I will give you in a very nice professional technical analysis if we hit over 3,000 likes. So all you need to do is hit the like button on this video, comment the alt down below, and I will do the most requested altcoin if we hit that target. That sounds fair enough to me, right? Uh, so I hope it sounds fair enough to you. That's uh, what I'll be doing if you are interested in that for the altcoins analysis. But I do definitely foresee a lot of potential right now and opportunities in the altcoin market. So uh, in terms of Bitcoin, though, yeah, we're currently just range bound, very clearly defined highs very clearly defined lows. We are range bound. And then obviously we trade this range until it breaks. When it breaks, we know our next levels to the downside. When this bottom of the CC breaks, we know we've got our next level to the upside. So ladies and gentlemen, for me, this is very simple, but effective trading. Trade the range until it breaks. When it breaks and you don't see these type of swing failure patterns, well, then you look for your next level to the downside right here we just had the most perfect swing failure pattern up at the range high we had the most perfect swing failure pattern these are the easiest type of trading opportunities because they're very easy to identify the invalidation and stop loss is very nice okay so that's basically the, the easiest trade to take and that's why we were ready and waiting for that one and made a made a lot of paper profits on that <laughs> um all i will say ladies and gentlemen is if you obviously want to follow along with our analysis if you want to see these predictions okay if you want to see the live trading then obviously we've got all this over on the discord and on our website chartchampions.com this is a new feature by the way that Igor has brought out obviously he's got his live trading stream tomorrow so if you want to see more live trading got the live stream tomorrow for you on that one and obviously this is a new thing that he's doing which is like trade recaps so he's just going to be recording his screen while he's taking those live trades. And then you can understand and see the entries, the take profits, the stop losses, all OK recorded. If he's not, during, you know, if it's not obviously during a live stream, you can see how that sort of plays out. And uh, so, yeah, that's a new feature that we've done here. Um, so, yeah, that's all I'm going to end with. If you want to see the live trading, we've got the live trading stream tomorrow. If you want to see those recaps, it's also over on the website. On top of the live training, of course, we've got the... Um, the courses itself which is all the educational content where if you want to understand the theory we go from beginners to obviously the expert levels so all of the courses are over on the website that includes the five minute condensed version speed runs the vault with all the cheat sheets and templates everything that you're going to need right now over at chartchampions.com so if you are interested in that see you over there that's where you're going to get the predictions that's where you're going to get the education and that's where you're going to get all of the trading updates from us so i hope that you've thoroughly enjoyed this video ladies and gentlemen if you have you know what to do hit that like button and i'm going to just sign out by saying thank you ever so much i love you all i hope this video has been of help and you've understood exact reasons why we got the bounce why we got the rejection and what i'm looking for next in terms of my levels and trading this range Thank you ever so much. Trade the range until it breaks. When it does break, you now know the next levels I'm looking for. I hope that you've thoroughly enjoyed and I'll catch you over on the website, chartchampions.com. Cheers, everybody. Thank you and goodbye. And of course, I'll end with the legal trade disclaimer. This is not financial advice. Do your own research. Trades on demo, paper trade accounts. Thank you and goodbye.